How are you all doing? I hope you are all doing fine. I'm also doing so very well, as you can see. We are in Asei Demu, Hamdalai. Yeah, yeah. This is where they say it's one of the most beautiful parts of Mali. Bye, guys. Come along with me and let me show you what we got here. They have a lot of luxury apartments here. One of them is Mikasa. Mikasa. That is where most, that's what they told me though. They are stars. Some of them stay. Do you want to <laughs> Oh, yes. Hey, this place, the bike riders, they are wild. If they see you walking on the you know it's not every place that you have the so trauma so you don't get so trauma disturbing you as you walk but it's rather the bike that worries you on the way they want to pick you up look at this place it's looking nice malians love a lot of monuments so let's get closer to the monuments here hey the last time i went to that hotel hotel de amiche jesus the security there, you guys. I don't have cash. When I asked one of them whether I can film, she said yes, but I should do it so that it wouldn't capture people. And I'm like, okay, lots of soldiers, so you don't know what to do in this country. But look at this place, extremely nice. This is. Hmm. Nice cream. So this is the monument of the candle. So you see the candle is up high. Sava. Mm -hmm. You do not light a candle and put it under your bed. You put it on top of the hill so that it can light up the whole country. So exactly what they have done here that is what the monument of the candle depicts that it was what i was told you guys look at this side of the street <laughs> okay so let's go to the monument of the candle <laughs> oh sometimes hey when i can feel free and film oh my goodness i love it so much hey, i'm telling you this place oh my goodness the security is extremely extremely uh how will i say it intense if i ask permission sometimes sometimes they'll even allow it but they will say okay you can only take pictures or make sure nobody comes in the video it's only you it's not like i'm complaining i understand their situation i know the reason why they are doing that because of what is going on in the country so i cannot blame them they are just trying to secure themselves and be on the safer side yes they are just trying to be on the safer side. So I understand perfectly well. Oh my God. Sponsor. Okay. So this is the monument of the candle. They have written something on it. La Centre et la Lumire de la Maison comme la personne et le fou de la création. So that is how it looks when you are here you can actually see every part of the street it gives you a perfect view of i say alhamdulillah look at that very beautiful i'm just here to show you the beautiful side of mali so you guys up there we have brooklyn which is uh, the food there, they said it's like KFC. And we also have nice cream, one of the best ice cream joints here in Mali. So we'll go and try the ice cream, but not Brooklyn. I'll just show you Brooklyn, where the restaurant is, but I'll not be uh, buying anything. Look at that side of the streets. Mm, this side is for beggars only they are not selling anything if you have something you have enough money on you you can just go there 
and give them something okay that is part of their culture i even learned when they give birth to twins uh, the twins are that is not my word so that's what they themselves have told me the twins are obliged to go out and beg for some time even if they are from a rich family they're supposed to go out and beg and it is part of their culture so that they will not be falling sick or something yes that was what they told me. They are not my words. So sometimes I understand. It's not like they are just, they've just decided to beg, but it is because of their tradition and what they believe in. That is why you see some of them on the streets begging. Some are actually twins. So that is it. Let's go to the ice cream joint called Nice Cream. You can see apartments and the offices you know some are offices and some are apartments at the very top sometimes you have apartments there there's one apartment called mikasa it is up there so when i'm done perhaps i'll work there and show you but this is a perfect view up here of the monument of the candle of course you do not light a candle and put it under your bed you put it on top of a hill so that it can light up the vicinity or the community or the small world that you find yourself in so exactly what they have done yeah i hope my videos are interesting seriously because eh filming here when you are filming cry your heart is just palpitating your heart will be palpitating <laughs> as if you don't know whether you are going to meet a policeman who will take your camera from you hey it happens always they have taken my camera more than <laughs> 10 times. <laughs> oh. So let's go. First of all, I've seen something like travels. Let's go to the ice cream joint first. When we are done, then I'll come and ask of the price of a uh, flight from Mali to Ghana. <laughs> let's go to nice ice creams first. Okay. This is it. They say this place has the best ice cream in Bamako. Okay, so I want to buy ice cream. Hello, please. I want to buy ice cream. Okay. Which cup do you want? A small cup. <laughs> they told me that this is the best ice cream joint <laughs> in Bamako. So I want to try it and see. All right. Sorry. One point five thousand. One. One thousand and five hundred. Okay. The small cup. Yeah. All right. So these are the ice creams that we have here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This cup. In which cup? Are you sell food too? You sell food as well? Ah, okay. So they said this is the best ice cream joint here. So these are the basics. The menu, if you want to check it. Okay. 500. Which is the best you have? Give me the best. Okay. This is the menu, but I just want them to give me the best they have. Okay. This is food. I do ice cream. So, I should go to it. Yeah. Mm, strawberry. I have to taste all. Oh. Six 
Okay. Yeah, so apparently these are the flavors that they have. They have strawberry, they have mango, vanilla, barabecan, cream, and what's not. And by what I've tasted, oh my goodness, I can't wait for my order. <laughs> Whoa! It's <laughs> Look at someone taking picture and enjoying herself. Oh my goodness! Yeah. Nice cream. Oh, maybe I should go and sit and wait for them because they are not ready. I'm tired. When they are done. Oh, which side is the best for me? To get a nice... Uh -huh. This is why I get very nice with you. I face this side. And I get the best. The best of the best video. So you guys, welcome to Bumaku. I love places that you can just feel free and do your thing. I said, when I went to that uh, hotel, oh my goodness. That was such a hassle, but this is okay. They said the best ice cream. Already they have given me something to taste. They want me to taste first before they serve me. They said, what do I want? And I said, they should give me the best that they have. Oh, okay. They have this thing here also that you scan it, then you get your menu. Nourish cream, Betty. Menu dessert. Menu for sale. Betty dejeuner. I don't even know what that means. You know, the girl took my tickets, but she's not serving me, so I had to come and sit. Now they are fighting over me. The name is bien bien. Something nice. No, I do put this on. What do you think about I do not I do not You can add strawberry. You can add this one too. Strawberry. Strawberry. Okay. Give me something nice. Okay. Guys, I said strawberry and he was pointing to something yellow, which is mango. I know strawberry is pink, so I had to say something nice. <laughs> Pardon, eh? No, 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 c'est pas votre faute. Ah, okay. No, c'est pas votre faute. Okay. Yeah, I was just telling her sorry. You guys, look at the presentation. What do you think? Okay, this is how it's been presented. They have given me a spoon. So this is going for 1,500 safer, which is 30 Ghana cities, you guys. 30 cities. Hey, I'm not even kidding. Like $3, you know? Look at the view from inside. So beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> the view from inside is so cute. Mm -hmm. So this is one of the beautiful places in Bamako, Mali. You can see how this place looks. Alright, so let's taste this thing and see how it tastes. Okay. Let me show you. Look, they have put some like is it crackers or something on it? Do you get? So they actually said that this is strawberry, the yellow thing is strawberry but mango, mango strawberry. It's okay, me yeah, I don't like sugary things, but it tastes good. It tastes good. This is how everything looks. That's the mango. And. Mm, it's really nice. So, when I'm done, I'll get back to you. We'll be taking some pictures over there. <laughs> we'll take a picture. You see that place? That's where they take a picture. So, 
Yeah, now I'm done. Thick. A very nice picture. And that will be it for us, okay? Yeah, I'll get back to you when I'm done with my delicious ice cream. Alright guys, so as you can see, I've emptied my glass of ice cream. I can tell you that it tasted so good and I can recommend this place because the service is good and uh, the place is clean cleaner it's cleaner than places that I've been so far yeah and also what do you think what do you think about the ambience leave a comment drop your comments and let me know but to me I feel like it's just cool after all, it's just for eating and taking some ice cream and some drinks. That's all. So, yeah, that is always how a normal restaurant looks like. So, kindly drop your comments and let me know what you think. So, we are going to take a picture over there where they have written ice cream and that beautiful art on that wall that is sparkling with lights. We'll be taking some pictures over there. So, I'll see you outside. Uh, as I'm done taking the picture and I'll be showing you uh, around the side of the neighborhood or the community where you can find a very nice apartment also anytime you are in Bamako so stay tuned and don't go away but do not forget to like the video at this point and also leave your beautiful comments and subscribe if you haven't already if you have already subscribed or oh, you are the best thank you so much for coming back to watch my beautiful beautiful video all right guys like i told you i went inquiring about ticket price from bamako to accra and it's approximately 500 dollars from the company ak group mali yeah they're very receptive professional and welcoming but guys the unfortunate happened i broke my leg guys i'm dead I broke my leg. Eee. I can't walk again. So this was what happened. As I was about descending their oh. walkway, guys, I got my legs twisted. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Ah, yeah. Guys, you may think that I'm kidding than my facial expression and my gestures, but the pain is really excruciating. But I just didn't show it on my face. Like, who am I even showing it to? Who sends me? I, 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 I. Wait. Wait. Hey. Wait. Hey. Are you huh? uh, Yes. I wait. What? <laughs> oh, guys, I'm dead. My my leg. Uh, I can't show you the place again. Wait. Jesus. Wait. Ooh. I <laughs>
to me you oh. i'm hurt for <laughs> you guys <laughs> i don't know i slipped and how will i even say it i didn't even fall but my foot it feels like uh is it it's not broken but i can't really walk well so anyways i was just here to ask of the price uh, of tickets here from here to ghana and look at what has happened to me but that's cool i'll get back to you all right guys so here we are at ak travels it's a travel and tour company they travel to everywhere in the world anywhere that you want to go to and you're in mali when you come here uh, you can get a ticket to any part of the world and um it is located in asia de mil alhamdulillah is this place say hamdulillah okay so this place is hamdulillah uh, it is just opposite the monument of the candle and it's also not far from nice cream it's just adjacent to this place so anytime you're in mali and you want to travel to any part of the world just contact them that is their phone line here as you can see two two three two zero two two five five six eight yeah and the other one is there so when you contact them you are good to go their service is good i just went there and i broke my leg the manager came to help me with the leg gave me water and the security everyone here is so good malians are good they are kind so yeah when you are in mali just feel at home come to them for your tickets to any part of the world and they'll serve you right okay all right so i'll see you guys there's another entry here <laughs> that they call brooklyn and uh, someone also recommended me to recommended it to me but i don't think i'll be going there look at this place so beautiful we have shops here everything nice this is the nicest place in Asi Debil. 
This is the nicest place. That's what they said. They said, Hamdulai is the nicest place. So you can see, I just want to show you the beautiful side of this beautiful country, Mali. Hey, you people, if I follow you, oh, if I follow you, I will rest though. I don't have small money. You see, they are still putting up new buildings. Oh, it's a renovation. Oh my God. Uh -huh. This is Mali, Bamako, Handelai. Nice place. Maison de Rev. Center of Information. Look at that. Dubai Mali. Dresses are nice. This is Brooklyn. They said food here is nice, but I'm not ready. So I'm just showing you. Brooklyn, they said their food is good, but I'm not going there. So I just want to be showing you here. Mercy, mercy, mercy. This is Dinah Apartments. Residence. Oh, you see? Bonjour. Savabie. C'est quoi? Restaurant. Ah, I thought it's dining apartments. Okay. okay, down there is a restaurant. What? Wait, wait. Down there is a restaurant. So I wanted to check if it's an apartment for rent. I wanted to check if that was their reception, the reception for the apartments, so that I can promote their place. But it is not. This road is leading to Lafia Buku. Lafia Buku. Look at how the buildings here are. Some of them are apartments. Apartments for rent. Oh, Mali Bamako. Most of them are so nice. Institutes of Beauty. Beauty. D.H. Rav Star. What did they do there? He's looking nice. Because this. Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh, wait. Oh! New buildings coming up. This one is new. Look at this side too. Very beautiful. The apartments and the under is offices and shops. Mm. That is what you get. I want to show you the Mikasa. The Mikasa, I hope there are no uh, security personnel there that will worry me. Always, they want to seize my camera. I have to explain and explain and explain. Although I don't put the camera on them. If they just see me with the camera, they want to take it from me. Mm, look at these apartments. Very nice, but they are expensive. BFA communication. Look at this side. New ones are springing up. The architecture here yeah, is always, if they want to do it, it is something else. This is a travel agency. Mali Souk. Oh. Nice, nice, nice. Beautiful Mali Bamako. Where the rich hide in Bamako, Mali. This is where they told me that the rich hide in Bamako, Mali. Seriously. Okay? Star times. Bonjour. Oh, wow. This is so beautiful. Wow, look at that, you guys. Wow, my friend told me that this place too is an apartment, they are very, very expensive. So, only the rich can live here. That was what he told me. Can you imagine? So, this is where the rich live in 
Bamako, Mali. Yeah, look at that. Very nice apartment. And mostly, he told me that mostly it's foreigners who come and rent up those places. I don't know if you can see far up there. Guys, Ooh, you may hear me say, like, wow, wow. It's because most of the that things that I see here are contrary to the impressions created about this country on the Look internet. On the internet, I got to know that it is one of the poorest countries in West place. Africa or even the world. And the people are impoverished. Don't they don't see. have food to eat. They are famished. Wow. No clean drinking water. And most importantly, it wow. is not safe to travel here because you mm. might get killed but i experienced the opposite it see? is love 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 Ooh, upon love place. and look at all this oh look at this place there are constructions going on still oh my goodness mm. ah, how are you Fine. Fine. <laughs> I'm good. Yeah, it's nice, nice, Bamako. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking for that Mikasa because they told me that that is where most of the rich people live. Man, this is my last vlog in Bamako. Do you get my very last vlog? Blog. Talking about Mali being famished My and homeless, okay? Blog. Food is one of the cheapest things that. that you can get here the in Mali Mama and Mali. accommodation oh is goodness. also Look relatively cheap yeah. if you stay in the outskirts of yeah. the city. When you talk about clean water, they don't wow. have sea, but they have a lot of fresh <laughs> water bodies. So drinking water too is wow. not a problem. Depending on where you live, you stay Beautiful. far off in the north, which is most of the beautiful. time uh, very arid, Whoa. then you may have wow, a wow, bit of wow. water problems. But in the southern part of the country, you do not have no water problems. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't understand anything. Yeah, I just respond. No! I am not in any way disputing the credibility Guys, of this place. mainstream media, especially the Western media, but I'm just saying they are too biased and that they you should see? be balanced in the stories they tell about Africa and other what? territories so. that they imperialize. Ah. Because mm -hmm. most of the time when you get to the field, you experience the opposite there Look might be one. an iota of truth in whatever they say completed. but it is not entirely hey, the case Look at this one. it's not yet completed hey darling in every country there's money or there are people who are rich but the rich in africa are few uh-huh you said i should pass you that is Mikasa. This is Batimat. Oh my goodness. Mali Sebon. No. This is Okadeko. Oh. So that is Air Burkina Faso. JK Logistics. And this side is an insurance company. Picture. Picture. They are looking at me. You guys look at that. Who told you money no there, Mali? Money day. There is money. This is the Nigerian embassy. This is the embassy of Nigeria. When you see their color, you know, white and green. Me, when I saw those soldiers there, I dodged them. I dodged them like I never saw them since. <laughs> ah! Woo! Thank you.
Mali Sal. So this is Mali Sal. Look at all these places. Um fried chicken. Is this the same as KFC? No, I don't even know. Ah. So this is Mikasa. Mikasa apartment. They say this is where the rich live here in Bamako. I'm so happy. Amish! Oh my god, I'm so happy. <laughs> oh my goodness, so we are in Mikasa. They said I should come. You guys, I'm so happy. Oh my god, I'll be lodging here tomorrow. Thank you. You see, this is Mikasa. You understand? That is why the rich hide there in Bamako. See? I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> okay, so if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe. Okay, don't forget to subscribe. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, I'm so happy. Library. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.